don't talk. The boy never stop, though they tell him no. I'm tryna be on top, but I tell him talk. The boy never stop, though they tell him no. What's up today, my fellow Madden soldiers? I'm feeling real good. Just got done with my daily run. I usually do about four or five times a week. So I can't say really daily run, but you know, basically like four or five times a week is mostly more routine than anything. So I feel like share that a little something personal about myself. You guys get to know me a little better. Anyways, so right now, let me go ahead and upgrade you on this team. Right now in a minute, we're going to open up this 94 plus OVR Legend Pack. We'll see what we get from that. It's from the level up packs. I think when you hit like 87 i'm 87 or nothing so i just barely got it um another thing too i, I did a video and in the video i ended up missing up on it so as you could tell my team has upgraded dramatically i'm actually a 98 now this was supposed to be like two different videos so now i have to recreate everything for you guys so you guys can see and now i'm just gonna go along and just share it with you instead and show you what i upgraded because yeah i ended up missing up the the last video that i did so anyways it's fine I'll go ahead and let you know. So what I did was, of course, this was the last guy I upgraded, which was uh, which was yesterday. Well, at the same time, this was the last one I did. But I upgraded my fullback. I ended up getting the tight end. I can't remember. I don't think I put this in the last video. So this was like the second video that I did, I think. I don't remember. But anyways, I'll go through them all. I upgraded Steve Young, of course, my, my fullback. I got Quentin Nelson now. Like I said, I can't recall who I put. So I'm, I'm just going to put everyone that I, that I know I upgraded. So you guys seen him, I know that. Ever seen Walls, I'm pretty sure you guys seen him. Joey Bowes upgraded him. So this is what happened. Okay, so the major upgrades, of course, was a Quentin Nelson and these two two guys right here, Steve Young and Mike Allstat. So when I upgraded this guy, for some reason, he, he stood at a 98. I had zone run on him. I put sprinter on him. You guys know from the last video that I did. And he didn't go to a 99. I was just, I was just like flabbergasted. Like, why this guy didn't go to a 99? I have, I even had the John Maddox coach, and he didn't do it. So, yeah. So I'm gonna let you know how I got him to a 99 in a minute. I'm sure those cams work as well as what this last thing that I did on top of it helped it out. But I'm surprised it didn't, it didn't like go up right away like this guy did. He went straight to a 97 from a 96 to a 97. But so we'll get into that in a minute. But anyways, so what I want to do right now before i get into it is i want to see this is the, the last guy I upgraded and it's important for you to see him see you see him with the stats his stats is immaculate but here's the thing though i need to take him out the lineup because i want to share with you how he looks okay hold on how he looks without all the cams on him because if you guys look at him right there so now all i gotta do is just click on him so because if you look at him right there you're going to think like, okay, well, I'm going to get him because it's going to be like that. He will only be like that if, yeah, he'll only turn like that if you have a lot of the Kims that I have. So anyway, as you could tell, he's a 93 throw power, 93 throw accuracy deep, 96 play action. His play action is, wow, his play action is better than I thought. I didn't think it was even going to be that good. Um, 93 throw under pressure. So they're pretty decent. Don't get me wrong. They're decent stats, but they're not powered up as much as that with the extra Kims that I got. So now that you see that. I mean, you seen Dak Prescott as I was probably talking about this, so his stats ain't really great at all. So let me put him back into the lineup, okay? So now that you've seen him without the Kims, now you're gonna see him with the Kims, and he's a 99. So this guy's gonna stay with me unless they upgrade another player that I want, which is Prescott. Unless he's just immaculate, then yeah. But most likely I end up getting him if he comes out with another card. But anyways, so his throw accuracy went up three times. His throw power. What was it before? I don't know. I think it went up a few more times. But, yeah, everything, it, it went up pretty good. The speed, he's at 90 speed. And he's actually good. I used him a few times in the games. He actually, he has a decent, he has a great spin move, but it's decent, though. Like, he spins a little pretty fast when it comes to uh, being a quarterback. So, it's pretty decent. And his juke move is vicious. I like, I'm pretty sure people are aware of it more more because you know, I'm pretty sure people use him when he first came out. I, I never have. This is the first time I put him on the team. And he's actually, he's actually decent. I'm actually happy to have him. He, he's, he's a good quarterback. So he gets the job done. John always, like I said, he was doing his thing, but he wasn't he wasn't upgradable because he was like a, a, a low version of the original one, and you couldn't really do much with him. So I needed one I could upgrade, which is this one here. He's like basically, he's, I don't even have to get another quarterback. He's a 99 already. But like I said, eventually in the future, if they give us one for free or they upgrade Prescott for some reason, which I believe they eventually will, then we'll go for there and pick up, pick up him. 
but yeah so he's looking decent i just wanted to show you guys that and my fullback is another one because i usually don't upgrade my fullback until like close to the more end of the season i guess you could say or end of end of the the madden seasons period so because i usually don't use them like that but you know what though i wanted to go fullback because i know i never usually do and this other fullback which i have which is franco harris it was just insane to upgrade him because the prices were so insane because you had to put players into a set. Like, there was so much you had to do, so it's hard to get him. You have to use a power pass, and I'm not going to do that on a fullback. So this guy was actually not that much. Altogether, Mike Allstat, I think his car was going for like 200,000 coins. And I all I had to do was just power up his card and put him into a set. Put put a, uh, Power up his card and put his main card into the set, and now he's powered up to a 99. He ended up to a 98, powered up to a 99. So... So yeah, it was more cost effective. So all together, I'll say I paid, we're going to say 300,000 coins for him completely in comparison to a million coins plus for Pranko Harris that I would have had to did. But look at him. He's 90 speed, 99 carrying, which is very good. So, you know, I'm pretty sure he'll fumble it, but he has a higher chance of holding on to the ball, catching lead block. He gets to lead the way, so I put it on him. Um, I don't know you can't tell right there, but I put lead the way on him. That's probably why, because he got high lead block, 88 run block, 92 impact block. And he's pretty decent, but... We'll go ahead and look at it so you guys see what I did. Okay, here we go. Here's upgrade. So you guys can see what there. I put lead block. I put energized if I run with them. You know, it actually really works. I put sprinter on them. So, yeah, he's looking decent. So I'm over here letting you guys know because you guys need to see the video when I upgrade them. And I want you guys to see it. So this guy. Okay, here it is. Well, Quentin Nelson. So he was a 90, as you said, after all those Kims on. So what I did was what you guys didn't see which I did record it once again and I missed it up but this oh I'm going to the wrong thing this is what I did I basically got John Madden's last slot from this last season which I didn't do oh I'm in the wrong area I'm going to this well, I'm going to solos huh yeah I'm tripping yeah from from last season I didn't get I had I had like 75 so I played a lot of games on I mean I played like 25 more games online in order to get it because I had to upgrade them because I was a little bit far back so, so I'm gonna work on I'm gonna start now I'm gonna work on series six but anyways this is what I did what what collectible well, can you sell these now or something hold on here whoa 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 before you're able only to do that one time hold on hold on hold on what hold on yeah, let me go check this auction block real quick. If, if you, if you could, I don't think you could sell them, but why are they repeatable? They shouldn't be repeatable if you're going to use them for one set. Well, that was, this is just something new because this is going to be a video what I what I thought that they're going to come out with in the future. One of the things that I thought of they were going to come out in the future was actually it might I might be jumping to conclusions was I figured they're going to yeah they don't have them, but that's one thing that I that, that I was going to predict that they're going to come out with one of the things that, uh, coming up in this still Madden 19 was. You're going to be able to auction them, auction them off, whatever, which I actually really help out. Now, I would buy them. I wouldn't even worry about Yeah, I would definitely would not buy them. It's a lot easier. Apparently not. There's nothing in the auction block. What else can I put it under? There's coaches, stadium, playbooks, you know. Yeah, there's nothing. That's it. So, apparently, I don't know. Maybe they're getting ready for something. I don't know. Eventually, they're going to, they're going to, that's, that's the way it's looking. That's. Yeah, that's kind of crazy. That's I didn't know that. Like before, it would just be complete and it'll show complete, and you couldn't repeat it. There's no first of all. There's no reason for you to repeat them. You have the you have the slot. You can't do nothing with them, far as I know. So unless you're able to quick sell them or something, I, I have no idea. But yeah, that's 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 new information. But anyways, let's go to them. Yeah, that's insane. Here we go, Coach Patton. So what I did was this. Next one's gonna be this one, but this is what I did. Oh, wrong one. Let's go. Okay, so I, I put Madden rushing on him. I had one already, so I put the, another Madden rushing, which is it basically maxed it out. And once I did that, he went up to a 99. That just boosts his OVR. But as you can tell, look at all these stats that added added to his card. So it boosted. It was able to boost him up to OVR. Another thing too that it did was it boosted. It boosted one of my other players to two OVRs. Watch, I'm going to show you right now. 
So you see that I, I got a John Madden collectible. So that's another thing that's new. But him, Zach Martin. Zach Martin went up two OVRs. He was he was he was a 96 powered up to a 96. He went up to a 97 with blue Kims. Now with this extra John Madden collectible, went to a 98. So that's how he's looking. So yeah, this team is looking pretty decent right now. I'm really liking it and enjoying it. I got some more upgrades that's gonna come in the future than I plan now. I'm waiting for those defensive tackles because I really want I know they're gonna come with upgrade cards and once they do, I'm gonna go ahead and uh whenever I can, you know, whenever I have the coins to do, I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade them. Another thing I want to share with you guys is this. This team team captains right here, these tokens, apparently you're getting 10 of them. I had no idea. So on my other account, which is a no money spent team. Most likely, I'm going to go ahead and start upgrading the player and just keeping my tokens on it. If I get them up to a 99, my team captain, I'm going to keep them and put the tokens in because I'm going to get more from the player than I am from the tokens. So I didn't know that. I'm glad I only quick sold one on my other account. I had no idea. But this one, I'm going to use, I'm going to do it right now. I'm going to upgrade one of my players with it, the, which is the last one, and then I quick sell the rest of them. But anyways, what I wanted to show you guys is here this 34 out of 100 these games. So... Just so you guys know, I don't know if you know yet, but I was just playing the same solo over and over because I'm basically leveling up with my team. So I played so solo over and over just for to level up because it's faster. However, it was giving me credit for the for the for the games. So just so you know that. So if you re if you did a solo career, if if you just want to get these herb and get these tokens, do the kickoff check get not kickoff, do the field goal one or whatever whatever it is to get get it done faster if you want. If that's what you guys want to do to get some coins. Do that, and it's gonna give you the credit. And if you don't believe me, then go try it. Look at, see how I'm gonna say I have 34. Go do it, and then if it come, you play this, play a solo that you already did, and if it says 35, then you know it works. But yeah, I'm telling you right now, that's all I've been doing, and I already got a few tokens, and I didn't even, I wasn't even doing it for that. I was just doing it more to level up. But I'm just glad it counts for something now, besides just leveling up. Um, oh yeah, here we go. I'm going to the wrong one. So right now we're gonna put the token into. Yeah, Shannon, Shannon Sharp. I was about to say Strayham. Here we go. We got the last one. I already opened it. So there it is. So I did that because he gets another extra speed as well as a few other stats. So it works for me. I'm really happy. That'd be cool if it goes to 100. Huh? I'll be looking nice. That's kind of good. The cards don't go to 100, at least in my opinion. But I mean, it would look nice just if, if they can max it all as if you can just with blue chems at least. Like allow the blue chems to do it or something. But. Now what we're going to do is that we're going to go to this right here. We're going to see what we're going to get from this. Ready? Here it is. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, I actually got to pull a full legend from this. Wow, full ultimate legend. I like that. I like that. I really don't be getting love like this. Wow. He's looking decent, too. He's, he's actually a good car. I mean, I, there's no reason for me to keep him because I got a few good linebackers. But let's go see how much he's going for. But that's coinage right there. That's Either way, that's coinage. It's a full legend. That's some coinage for me. Go ahead and just... Let me see. He might just be... I mean, I could just use him from training, too, if I really need to. He's only going for 193,000. So I'm gonna hold on to him because I don't know who they're gonna come out with. If I need training, I'll probably use them for training. If I need coins, I'll go ahead and sell them. But yeah, I think I'll probably get more out of it for training than I would for the coins either either way. But yeah, wow. I pulled the full ultimate legend out of that 94 plus pack. Um, I'm pretty happy. I'm pretty happy. So let me see what else we got right here. You guys already know about the level ups and all the other stuff. The team tapping, so yeah. But wow, yeah, I'm just still in shock right now. I actually pulled up for Ultimate Legend. That it really don't happen as much for me. So yeah, I actually did it. But yeah, that's so 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 let's get back to real real, real quick. So the thing that I upgraded was my fullback. I upgraded my quarterback, Steve Young. I got Quentin Nelson. Like I can't remember in the last video all you seen, but you know, I'm gonna repeat again, Shannon Sharp. I got a middle linebacker, which is Mr. Smith, because I can't pronounce his, his name. And so, Joey Boza. I think they're the main ones that I got to, uh, to help upgrade this team more. I'm pretty sure I, I, I could have. One of those dudes probably were on my last video. One of the cards, I don't remember, but I'm going to tell you anyway. And another thing which was big was the, was the upgrade token for the 
John Madden. So that was pretty big because it boosts, as you can tell, it boosts up my OVR on my team. And now I can focus on getting the the other physical slot, which is not going to be speed or anything. It's going to be like physical, finesse move or something like that. So I'm pretty sure that's going to help my team out too. So I can start working on that, upgrade that. And then now I hope to open up a, the Ultimate Legend pack to see what I was going to get. I we I'm getting a full Ultimate Legend. So that's pretty decent. So until next time, man, you know, thank you guys all for tuning in. Comment below. Tell me what you'd like to see in the future. I, I'm definitely going to have more content coming. Sub to the channel if you ain't sub. Please take the moment right now if you ain't subbed to please sub to this channel. I will have more great content coming out. And please like this video. Uh, please like this video too. You really help out. I really appreciate you guys taking the time to look at this video, to, to comment, you know, to take time out your day to, to, to spend time with me and, and to help build our team together, you know. So once again, you guys all have a nice day. Thank you very much for tuning in. I'm out.